Peppermint OS is a fantastic lightweight Linux distribution designed for older and newer computers. I wanted to install this in my old 32-bit ThinkPad R40, but I couldn't. It came up with an error message that I need to force. P-A-E. Ooh. Well, there is a workaround. Uh, let me show you how to do that. All right, so I shot some video with my uh, cell phone. And I tested this twice, this method with uh, Peppermint OS and uh, Lubuntu. And it both, both worked. I was able to get the installer running. On my ThinkPad R40, I decided to go with Peppermint OS. So if you try to install Peppermint OS from a USB stick and choose, you know, try it live or hit default or something like that, uh, and your machine is older and it does not have PAE, enabled you will get this warning PAE disabled use parameter force PAE this kernel requires the following features now let me, let me show you this uh, it's a little fuzzy I, I do apologize for that but I think it's clear enough to take a look at this so force PAE at your own risk uh, the following features not present on the CPU PAE unable to boot so it does say force PAE, but it doesn't really say how do I do that. So what I did, I forced the reboot from my live USB stick. Then when you get to the blue screen where it says, you know, try Peppermint Live or, or Lubuntu or whatever, hit the tab key. Hit tab, and this will bring you to this screen of what you see here. Now after the two dashes from the left, hit space. Now this will clear up in a second. Hit the space key and type in force. P A E. Force P A E. Enter. And this will allow you to install Peppermint OS or Lubuntu or an, another operating system that requires P A E. So I'll show you this again. Warning P A E disabled. Use parameter force P A E to enable at your own risk. I didn't. I tested this. I installed Peppermint OS twice using this method and even did a live stream uh, with Peppermint with less than a gig of RAM in my old ThinkPad R40. I, I thought I had a couple of RAM, RAM chips laying around for that ThinkPad, but I didn't. The point is I got it to work and I did, I did not notice any issues. So once again, once you get to the blue screen to try Peppermint, hit the tab key. This, this will bring you to this command prompt. After the two dashes hit a space, make sure there is a space between the dash and when you type in force PAE. And this will allow you to try Lubuntu, Peppermint, Zubuntu, or whatever OS that requires a PAE compatible computer. And that's it. So let me know if this uh, works out for you. I'm running Peppermint OS uh, in my ThinkPad R40 and it seems quite stable. I want to thank you for your pledges of support to this Total OS Today technology channel. You can support the channel through PayPal. If you would like to sponsor a future live event uh, with, a, they, with a technology topic of your choice, you can do so. Please send me an email at TotalOSToday at gmx.com. You do not have to appear live on the show to sponsor a live event. Uh, this channel will respect your privacy. Ooh, imagine that. All right, guys, remember that the best OS, the best operating system is yourself. Please use it wisely. Take care.